We have put together, I think, the most extensive and inclusive voter fraud organization in the history of American politics. Let me say it again. The 2020 election was the most secure election in American history. Let me begin by asking a very simple question. Do we know the truth about what really happened in the 2020 election? I think millions of Americans know something went wrong and they have little pieces and no one's really put it together. I'm agnostic on this question and I, I am awaiting more information. If I believed the president were a Nazi, I might steal an election. Bold accusations require bold evidence and they haven't seen it. We have been working on something big. Show me the money. Can we meet? I've been working with Greg Phillips. He has a deep background in election intelligence. True the Vote has the largest store of election intelligence for the 2020 elections in the world. No one has more data than we do. We identified in Atlanta 242 mules that went to an average of 24 drop boxes. But Philadelphia alone, we've identified more than 1,100 mules. What is a mule? Person picking up ballots and running them to the drop boxes. This is not grandma out walking her dog. Bad backgrounds, bad reputations. They are interested in one thing, that's money. And in no shape, in no way, in no time, is that legal. This is organized crime. Do you have video evidence? Four million minutes of surveillance video around the country. What you're about to see is disturbing. So this is uh, one o'clock in the morning. Don't we all vote at one o'clock in the morning? <laughs> On one night, this person, this mule, went across six counties to 27 different drop boxes. I call it the Mexican mafia, seriously, because uh, they, they work like that. This is jaw-dropping. What you showed is frightening. It's just sickening to me. Now we come to the most important question of all. Was the magnitude of vote trafficking enough to tip the balance in the 2020 presidential election? It's not a leap to say this would have made a difference. They have ruined Election Day in the United States of America. That's provable. And that's enough for me to fight the left with every fiber in my body. Without free and fair elections, we are not a democracy. We are a criminal cartel masquerading as a democracy. 2,000 mules in select theaters, May 2nd and 4th. Virtual premiere, May 7th. Stream May 8th at Salem Now or Locals.